Okay, what's up everyone? Uh, this is a lot of sweetness 2011 and I have a video showing you how I'm going to be showing you how to create this neat little realistic um, glass uh, ice effect, excuse me, in GIMP and you can actually use it to place it into your text when using your text uh, creative way I guess and so but the one thing I want to mention is uh, I've got this this uh, idea from GIMP chat and it's pretty neat cool people on there that do this type of stuff but I wanted to make a video showing people how to do that so I'll go ahead and get started first you want to go to file new and create a new document I'm going to change the template to US letter 300 ppi the only reason is because it gives a better quality picture and in this case it really helps and I'm going to change the document to landscape and then I'm going to press OK now from there with that layer selected go to filters render clouds and then solid noise then what you want to do is set the detail to about four or five somewhere around in there and the X size to about six point six point four and the Y size to 4.8 and once you have that just press OK now once that gets done what we're going to do is we're going to go to colors and then colorize and we're going to change the color of that effect so once this gets done it, my computer is really slow I hate this I'm sorry y'all so okay now that that's done what you want to do is go to colors colorize and we're going to change the color to kind of a blue color I guess and once I get this to the right color I guess I'll let y'all know and tell you the numbers that I've got okay let's say this probably will work pretty decent uh, my hue is set to 222 saturation is at 60 and lightness is at negative 1 and now I'm just going to press OK now what you want to do with that layer still selected go to filters light and shadow and then go down to plastic wrap if you do not have this I'll put a link in the description below and so you can actually add this to your script uh, in your GIMP folder and then all you have to do is just restart GIMP and you can actually use this and so yeah but go to plastic wrap and just leave everything at default it's pretty uh, pretty neat stuff so just leave everything at default and just press OK now once you do this, man, it's, it really looks pretty awesome, I'd have to say. And props goes out to the people on GIMP chat. These people are crazy, dude. This takes a little bit. I guess it doesn't help that my computer is really slow. I'm going to get a new one pretty soon, so... Okay, now, it already, it already looks pretty decent. I mean, I mean, come on, man, that looks friggin' awesome. It already looks like you know the white ice anyway now what you want to do is merge that layer down to one single layer and now you can go to colorize we'll make it a little bit darker go to colorize brightness and contrast and we're going to turn uh, turn the contrast up and turn the brightness down a little bit and let's say that's what you want to use my brightness is at negative 41 and contrast is at 26 and then press OK and I mean that's pretty much it guys that's that's pretty neat stuff uh, if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and as always uh, subscribe comment and check out all my other videos um, and like I said, I'll put the link in the description below for the for the filter called Plastic Wrap, so you can actually use it. And if you're having problems on where to place that in GIMP, 
just let me know and I'll make a video showing you where to place that. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Peace out.